Hey guys, welcome to another video for simonsvideo.com and my name is Simon Tay and today I'm going to do a DIY uh, instructions on how to make a tablet mount using Velcro. I'm going overseas and I've been searching for a solution to mount my iPad Air on the back of the, the airplane seats. It can hang up very easy so I'm going to teach you on how to make this today. Step number one is to stick three velcros about 15 cm uh, length of the velcro which is the loops part of the velcro a bit softer part of the velcro. This is the part where you hang on to the, the other velcros uh, mount right so on the top side you stick two velcro together one is the soft uh, loops the other part is the uh, harder uh, hooks of the velcro and make sure you stick them together very very carefully uh, because in any mistake you actually form a, a, you know a very bad uh, bond and you create a U shape uh, follow the, the exact method I made so it remains flat next is to create two pillars the pillars are made out of the, the velcro that is the hook part of velcro and now I'm actually creating a little section of the pillars uh, on the top side so when I actually stick this uh, pillar onto the uh, velcro like this uh, the back of the pillar uh, also have this uh, um, what do you call it the velcro that is the softer uh, curly uh, velcro on the back of this pillar now it's almost done except that uh, the pillar is not long enough uh, one thing to note is um, you can actually buy a longer velcro uh, so that you can, you can actually uh, skip this step however I purchased uh, all the velcros in 15 cm section so unfortunately I have to do this step to extend the velcro to a longer uh, pillars on both sides of this uh, mounting uh, velcros right so another thing is uh, if you can um, buy those velcros um, make sure behind is the sticky type of velcros right so from here you can just um, mark the area where you will pull off the white piece of paper to stick to the other velcro which is uh, meant for an extension of uh, this uh, velcro um, so another thing is uh, do not pull all the way uh, the, vel the, the white piece of paper the idea is to stick on to the top side of the airplane seat so that you will not uh, stick the rest of the velcro onto the airplane seat at the back of the airplane seat which usually uh, have this uh, uh, airplane uh, display of the movies so you do not want to stick on to the uh, you know, permanently stick on to the the, the, tab, the the little screen LCD screen so now this uh, mounting is actually done uh, simply put the, the casing on top of this mount and there you go you can actually mount your um, you know your tablet behind the airplane seats uh, however if you want to stick at home uh, for example I have a, a table with a little bit of a section on the top you can actually stick uh, this onto the table uh, if you want to choose to stick onto um, for example the fridge uh, you can just skip all the steps and then stick three velcros onto the fridge and then permanently uh, allow you to stick uh, the, the the tablets onto the fridge well basically that's it thank you very much for watching simon's video have a nice day see ya bye bye well basically that's it for this video remember to like comment share and subscribe and check out the previous video and a free gems video to support this channel thank you very much for watching see ya bye bye Calvin Hu, which is unknown in my clan, actually requested me to uh, show this replace of 100% demolish of his base. Uh, and I'm going to show you why uh, the enemy can actually demolish this base. First off, he actually uh, dropped me a couple of uh, level 6 giants and two wall breakers to uh, attack one section and then drop about 20 level 5 uh, hot riders all at once and one big giant bomb. Boom. Okay, it doesn't hurt much because there's a healing spells. Uh, then one single spring trap uh, badly placed 
only spring off one single uh, hot riders um another healing spells and you can see that the hot riders are actually invulnerable under the two healing spells and now the hot riders are actually running around uh without any stoppage and you can see this uh town hall nine is slightly premature uh uh, compared to the level 5 hot riders uh, premature town hall uh, base is a little bit hard to defend such a uh, onslaught of a uh, high level hot riders uh, but unfortunately you can see that even the spring trap itself is not placed very properly a uh, spring trap should be placed right beside um you know a resource and a uh, towers to stop uh, the hot riders and you can see the pathway of the hot riders uh, and you can actually plan where you're going to place the spring traps unfortunately for this case the spring, spring trap is not exactly very effective against hot riders so be very very careful on where you place the spring traps uh, basically after all the defensive towers are taken out uh, you can easily uh, take out the rest of the buildings by uh, the heroes barbarian king and archer queen without any damage uh, which means they can reuse the the heroes again in the next battle uh, so this is a very 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 powerful attacking methods unfortunately it utilizes quite a number of hot riders which means uh, a, a usage of uh, dark elixir is required but uh, this is a very very nice revenge tactics well basically that's it thank you very much for watching Simon's video